recently received a request about how to switch from Super SU to Magisk. So I figured I'd do a little va a vague summary of how to do this since I cannot do it for all devices. It will depend on your specific device and how you are able to remove Super SU. So a lot of people are worried about the direction of Super SU since the sole developer recently, I guess not recently, a couple of years ago sold the rights to a Chinese company. That plus the fact that it is closed source has some people worried about the future of the of the project. So a lot of them are moving over to Magisk for that reason because it is open source and because it offers the module feature, the systemless module feature that a lot of people want now. So to switch from SuperSU to Magisk, we first need to uninstall and get rid of SuperSU. Now one way you can do this is through the SuperSU application. There is a complete unroot option there. However, sometimes an, a phone will not boot properly into, for instance, the custom recovery if there is not a root solution installed. So you can also flash this, this un-su zip file that I will have a link to in the full tutorial that will be linked below this video. So all we need to do, as I said, we need to get rid of SuperSU and then we just need to install Magisk. So once you download both Magisk and that unsu zip file, we're just going to reboot your device into recovery mode. And by recovery mode, I mean TWRP or any custom recovery that allows you to flash and install zip files. Now if you want, you can also simply just flash the stock kernel, the stock boot image for your device, and that can be located in the firmware of your device. Usually if you look at the firmware, you can extract the contents and find that boot.img file, and you can flash that right in here, right in TWRP if you'd like. But since we're going for the more universal way here, that's why I'm just going to suggest the unsu zip file. So here we're just going to, we're going to tap on install. We're going to locate where we downloaded that unsu zip file. And then you just swipe the arrows to the right to install that zip file, which will uninstall SuperSU. This will also uninstall other root methods as well. Once that's done, press the home button, tap on install again. Then we're just going to tap on the magisk.zip file. Again, just swipe the white arrows to the right to install. It's going to mount a couple of the partitions. Then it's going to check and then patch the boot image kernel after it's done backing up the stock boot image. And then once that's done, we can just go ahead and tap on the reboot system button, unless you need to do anything else within TWRP. And that's going to boot us back up into Android, where you should see that SuperSU is no longer installed, and that it has been replaced with Magisk. So that is how to replace SuperSU with Magisk.